Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.com. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Raspbian OS on a PC, originally designed for Raspberry Pi. So for this, we're going to need the uh, Rufus app and the Raspberry Pi OS ISO. Also, a 2 gigabyte or larger USB device. Once you go to the Rufus uh, website, you scroll down a little bit and here download the uh, Rufus app. In my case, it's a 3.18. Now, once you have all that, just go ahead and run Rufus. And here, this is really simple. It automatically detected my USB. If not, just click on the drop down to select the USB device and then uh, select the ISO. In my case, it's in the Downloads folder, so I'll just click on Select and browse for that ISO. Double click to select and click on Start. It's that easy. You'll be prompted with this screen. I'm going to sum up this screen. If it doesn't work when you create an ISO, then create a DD image. Nothing really bad will happen. All it will do is, obviously, no matter which one you choose, it will delete all files in that USB device. Confirm, click on OK, and it will start creating the Raspbian OS bootable USB. Done. Once done, close the uh, Rufus app, eject the USB device, and plug it into the computer you are going to install Raspbian. I have plugged in my USB device to the Trishkey Green G1 Mini PC. The same applies to any PC, including a laptop. Power it on and make sure you press or tap on the proper functions key to enter the boot menu. Here, select the USB device. Hit enter. If it doesn't work, then enter BIOS or setup. Go to boot uh, tab and here, change the boot mode from UEFI to legacy and again save and exit and go through the same process once you reboot and you'll be prompted with this screen select graphical install select your preferred language Hit continue. Here, this is optional. It is telling you that it's missing some firmware files. So if you have such media to insert it, in my case, I'll select no and continue. Partition disk, here select Guided, Use Entire Disk, as recommended. And now be careful which drive you choose because it detects the USB as well. So make sure you select the hard drive, in my case is the SDA 256 gigabyte. Select it and again hit continue. Select all files in one partition. Finish partition and write changes to disk. And here, confirm your changes. This means it will install Rasp, uh, Raspbian OS on the hard drive and it will delete all the information replacing it with Raspbian OS. So here, select yes and click on OK. Install the group bootloader on the hard disk, select yes. Here I'll, again, make sure you select the hard drive. In my case is forward slash dev forward slash SDA, the 256 gigabyte, because it also reads the USB device. Hit continue.
OK, now hit continue. Remove the USB device from your PC and you will boot now to the um, Raspbian OS. Now with Raspbian installed on your PC, you can actually turn this PC now into a personal cloud storage. I got all the necessary links in the description box below. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.